And I think if we see anything really unique about the energy science market, it's about the, the overlaps of the people who do this kind of work. That uh, the fusion that needs to take place between the theoreticians and the computational scientists, taking it to the people who work at the molecular scale, to the people who work at the engineering scale, has to be woven together much more tightly than in some branches of science. How do we give people the tools where, where people who think quite differently about a problem can get together and sit in one place around one set of tools, whether they be computational tools or visualization tools, where they might sit and be able to create 3D models of a, of a, of a, mo a molecule that they can all see at the same time. And our job is to provide these spaces to think about how people communicate globally with one another. It's just ubiquitous. Scientists believe that I need to be able to talk to that person in Seoul, Korea right now. And they want to be able to see them, share their data, look at the same 3D image with their friends and colleagues all around the world. So we're trying to create fusion spaces where they can do that.